Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Katja. Today I have a compact workout for you. We're going to flow and strengthen and get our heart rate up just a little bit. So all you need is yourself and a mat. And then let's come and join me, we'll begin. So sitting with your legs out in front of you, feet hip distance apart, hold on to the back of your thigh and sit up as tall as you can, lengthening out of your pelvis, reaching up through the crown of the head. We we'll take a nice deep breath in through the nose and exhale out through the mouth. Relax your shoulders down, inhaling through the nose. Exhale, start to curl back into a C curve, straight away focusing on your abdominals, drawing back. Inhale, roll yourself back up, shoulders over pelvis. Exhale, curling back again, waking up our abdominals. Inhale, roll yourself up. Exhale, curling back. Inhale, roll yourself up. This time, we're going to roll all the way down. Let your legs sit heavy in your hands and then see if you can roll down smoothly with control. Bring your knees in towards your chest, placing your hands both around your right shin. Extend your left leg out 45 degrees. Draw your shoulders down, making sure your lower back supported by using your tummy muscles. Inhale here, single leg stretch. Exhale, switch. And switch. And switch. Keeping your trunk, your chest, your head as still as possible as you keep switching your legs. Your breath supports the movement. Keep curling forwards. If at any point you need to support your head, you can bring one hand behind your head. We've got four more. Three, two, one. Hug the knees into the chest and lower your head all the way down. Just rock your head gently side to side. Replace the right foot down to the mat. Stretch down your left leg, left hand behind your head, and your right arm stretches all the way back. Just give yourself a moment, check that you're nice and straight. Inhale to prepare. On the exhale, bend your left knee in towards you. Curl your head and chest forwards. We're going to reach on a diagonal with our arm past the outside of our leg. Inhale, stretch it away. Exhale, this time a straight leg, reach up to the outer ankle. So we alternate, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, curling, bend leg. Inhale, reach. Exhale, reach up to the ankle. Good, let's keep that going. Maintain your hips nice and stable. As you're moving your limbs and the trunk. One more here. Lengthen and reaching up. Inhale, stretch it out. Exhale, switching sides. Extend the other leg, the other arm and the other hand back behind your head. Ready for your second side? Breathe in. Breathe out. Bend your knee in. Curl, reaching past the outside of your leg. Inhale, stretch it away. Exhale, long leg, reach up. Inhale, exhale, reach, breathe in, breathe out, reach up high towards the anchor, inhale, exhale, reach across, inhale, and reach up high, good, one more set, I hope you feel this in your abdominals, and release. Well done. Good. Now bringing both arms down beside you. Slide your feet in. Both legs are bent. Your feet are about hip distance apart in line with your hip joints. Breathe and prepare. As you breathe out, 
you're going to curl the tail off the ground, start to roll your pelvis, your spine slowly up into a pelvic tilt. Engaging your glutes and hamstrings now. See if you can make a long line from your shoulders to your knees. Inhale, exhale, roll slowly down. Vertebrae by vertebrae, articulating your spine down. Inhaling, exhale. Again, abdominals sinking down, curling the tailbone up, your sacrum, your lower back, your middle back. Press into your feet and even into your arms. They're nice and active. Inhale. Exhale, roll slowly back down. We have one more here. Inhale. Exhale, rolling up. Your knees are reaching directly forwards in line with your toes. Inhaling. Exhale, peel slowly down. Good. Now we're adding on. Inhale. Exhale, roll the hips back up. Now pressing into your right foot, pick up your left knee tabletop position. Inhale, tap your bottom down. Exhale, press your hips up. Inhale, tap down. Exhale, press up. You're going to really feel that in your standing leg, your right side. It's working really hard. One more. And lift up. Now hold your hips up. Extend your leg. Lower your leg down about the middle of your standing leg calf. Flex your foot. Lift your leg up. Press it down. Flex. Lift it up. Two more. Down and lift it up. Down and lift it up. Place your foot all the way down. For a moment, center yourself on both feet. Breathe in. Breathe out, we go straight away to the second side. Switch legs, pick up the other leg. Ready, we lower the pelvis down, inhale. Exhale, push yourself up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press up. Inhale, down. Exhale, lift. Try and get those hips to be nice and level, lower. And lift up. Extend the top leg, reach it up, reach it up, inhale. Exhale, lower your leg without your hips dropping. Lift the leg up. Point your toes to lower. Flex your foot to lift. Point to lower. Flex to lift. Point to lower. Flex to lift. Bend your knee. Place your foot all the way down. Reach your arms all the way back behind you. Press into your feet. Lift the hips higher. Lengthen your tailbone forwards. Keep your ribs in. Inhale. Exhale, roll slowly down. Hug your legs in towards your chest, hands under your thighs. And the same way how we got down, we're going to rock ourselves up to sitting. Extend your legs as wide as the mat. And just give yourself a gentle stretch over your legs. Stretch out those hamstrings. Move a little bit around. Stretching out. Now bring yourself all the way up to sitting. We're going to keep our legs in this position, flexing your feet. If you feel your legs are tight, it's difficult to sit up tall, bend your knees a little bit, okay? If it's available for you to sit with your legs long, nice and tall, keep your legs long. Hands behind the head, lengthen through your spine. Gently press your head back a little bit. Your elbows, you can just about see them from the corner of your eyes. Now we're going to inhale, start turning your chest. Exhale, open your arms out wide into a T-shape. Inhale, bring your hands back behind your head. Exhale, facing forwards. Inhale, turn the other way. Exhale, open your arms. Can you lift and sit a little bit taller? Inhale, hands behind the head. Exhale, facing forwards. Again, inhaling. Exhale, shoulders down, breathe in, hands behind the head, exhale, center, inhale, twist, exhale, reach out through your fingertips, palms are facing up, inhale, hands behind the head, exhale, forwards, one more each side, and rotate, open your arms, keep lifting, hands behind the head, back to the center, 
Last one, twist. Open your arms, hands behind the head, and back to the center. Release your arms down, bending your knees. We're going to find our balance, just going slightly behind your sit bones, and see if you can bring your feet off the ground. Have your feet close together. Knees are very slightly open, about as wide as your shoulders. Hands around your shins, your ankles. Tuck the head in. We're going into rolling like a ball. Keep your shoulders down. When you roll down, only roll to the shoulders, not onto your neck. Inhale, start to roll back. Exhale, roll up. Try and stay really in this nice tight shape. Inhale, roll. Exhale, finding your balance. Two more. Roll back and forwards. Roll back. Try and keep it smooth. And up. From here, place your hands underneath your calves. Can you extend one leg up and bring the foot back down? Try the other side, lifting and down. Now again, just do your best. If your leg doesn't go all the way straight, that's okay. You're just working towards that. One more. And down. Now you can come back and repeat your rolling like a ball position. Or we can try and extend both legs up, holding onto the ankles, the calves. Now we're going to rock back. Reach with your feet up and see if you can rock up and find your balance. Rolling back, legs up high. And when you come up, reach your legs up as well. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Last one. And rock yourself up. From here, bring your legs together. Maybe you can go of your legs. Teaser position, holding your legs. And then cross your legs. And come all the way onto your hands and knees. Well done, these are not easy. Now on your hands and knees, stretch out your fingers, hands a little bit in front of your shoulders, tuck your toes under, we're going to get a really nice stretch in our downward dog or down stretch, lifting your hips up nice and high, feet hip distance, take a moment here, inhale and exhale. Now we're going to inhale, rock forwards into plank. Make sure the tailbone is pointing to your heels, crown of the head reaching forwards. Exhale, lift your hips up and back again. Inhale, rock forwards into your plank. And exhale, lift your hips back up. Let's do three more. Strengthening our whole body, our shoulders now and arms as well. And again, rock forwards. Abdominals lifted and up. Last one. Rock forwards, keep pushing the floor away. You're doing a great job, hold it. And then bring your knees carefully down. Give yourself a brief moment in child's pose. Maybe wiggle your hands a little bit just to release your wrists. Now coming back onto your hands and knees, extending one leg out behind you. So let's start perhaps with the left leg. Reach out long through the crown of the head. Abdominals engaged. Inhale here. Exhale, lift your leg up. Inhale, tap it down. Exhale, reach. Inhale, lower. Now, making sure that you're not arching into your lower back, please. You're keeping your hips nice and level. Almost feel you're tucking your tailbone down a little bit. This will make your glutes and hamstrings work harder as you're lifting your leg. We've got three more. Lift and lower, lift and lower and lift. Hold your leg up. Bring the opposite arm of your straight leg down onto the elbow and then we can reposition this hand maybe coming off your wrist to give your wrist a little break. Turning your chest to the side, keep reaching through your leg. Draw the abdominals in, lengthen through the crown of the head. Now we're going to do our rainbow legs like a rainbow movement. Perhaps start a little bit smaller with your movement first, just to get a feel for it. And then when you feel stable, you can make the movement a little bit bigger if you like. 
Continue to breathe in and out. Calmly. We're working now our outer hip muscles. Good, couple more. Keep pushing away from the ground. You're not sinking into your arm. Now realign your leg with your body from here, keeping your knee nice and high. Bend your knee into the shoulder. Exhale, flex the foot, push the heel away. Inhale, bend. Exhale, push it away. Inhale in. Exhale, push. One more to go. Inhale in. Exhale, push. Hold. Finally, 10 little pulses. Up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Relax your leg down. Child's pose. Sit back to your heels. Relax your head. And then roll yourself up into your high kneeling position. Meet me on your knees. Knees are still under your hips. Lengthen your tailbone down. Palms facing forwards. Let's roll our shoulders back and down. Inhale. Exhale. Keep a long line through your body. Leaning back as your arms press forwards and up. Inhale, coming forwards. Exhale, leaning back. If this hurts your knees in any way, please take care, back off. Smaller movement, or you can just do the arm movement. And forwards, two more to go. And forwards, last one. And forwards, well done. Making our way back onto our hands and our knees for the second side, extending now the other leg out. Just take a moment, push the ground away, chest lifted, head in line with your spine, abdominals engaged. Inhale. Exhale, lift the leg up. Inhale, lower. Exhale. Inhale, lower. Exhale. Try and really squeeze your glutes, muscles around your sit bone on this side. Feeling your hamstrings engage. Keep going. Three more. Good. The rest of your body is nice and steady and lift. Hold your leg up. Now the opposite arm to your straight leg is going to come down onto the elbow, elbow under the shoulder. The other hand you can reset it a little bit out to the side. Allow your body to open towards the side. Think still about lengthening from the toes to the crown of the head. Now start to move into your rainbow legs. Switching forwards and backwards. Start a little bit smaller and if that feels good you can make the movement bigger if you like. Good. Try not to hold your breath. Beautiful straight legs. Last one. Lift your leg up in line with your body. Now bend the knee direction of your shoulder. Flex your foot and push the heel away. Inhale, bend your knee. Try and keep your knee lifted. Exhale, push the heel away. Three more. Inhale, bend. Exhale, extend. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. And out. Finally, beautiful long leg, tiny pulses. Up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And relax. I hope you felt that in your hips. I certainly did. Just take a moment, inhale, exhale. We're going to repeat our kneeling position one more time. This time, let's open our arms out to the side, palms facing forwards. Again, check the shoulders are down, abdominals engaged, front of the hips lifting, nice and open. Inhale, exhale, leaning back again, bringing your arms close together and open the arms. 
Breathe in. Breathe out, leaning back. And inhale, coming forwards. Couple more. Working those thighs. Exhale. And come back. Release your arms down. Roll your shoulders. Good. Let's come on to our sides. We're going to start on our elbow. And then we have an option to progress or you can choose to stay here. So the top leg is in front of the bottom leg and your elbow is in line with your hip and more with the bottom leg to keep your balance. Now lift the underneath side. We're going to inhale. See if you can extend your legs into a side plank. Reach your arm up. Exhale, keep lifting your waist as you thread your arm underneath you, behind you. Inhale, reach your arm up. Exhale, come slowly back down. Let's try again. Inhale, hips up, reach. Exhale, thread the needle. Inhale, arm up. Exhale, come down. Good, so you can stay here. Particularly if your wrists are sensitive, you're worried about your wrists, stay there. Otherwise, give it a go. Turn your fingers to the slim edge of your mat. Now this time we're going to turn the top knee pointing up to the sky. Same setup. The top foot is in front. Inhale. Exhale. Here's your lovely big side over lift. Now from here, we're going to thread the arm to the opposite leg and lift the hips up high. Inhale, come back into your side plank, side over. Exhale, release your legs down. And again, inhale, reach up. Exhale, lift your hips as you reach with your arm to the opposite leg. Inhale, back into your side plank. Exhale, bending your knees, sit down. Last one. Watch your shoulder, rock that shoulder down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lift your hips, abdominals lifted, inhale back into your side plank, release it down. Well done. Any leg position that works for you, for your knees, your hips, side stretch, stretching up the arm that you've been leaning on, circle your hand, it's very strong in our wrist, let's release that and come up. Good. Let's swing our legs around. We'll do the same on the other side. So let's all start on our elbow, our forearm. Top leg in front, legs a little bit bent. When you're ready, already prepare, making sure your shoulders drawing down and you're lifting away from the floor. Inhale, lift up, straighten your legs. Exhale, thread the needle. Try and lift the waist even higher. Inhale, arm up. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, up. Exhale, thread the needle. Inhale, arm up. Exhale, down. Good. You can stay here or up onto your hand. Hand slightly away so you've got somewhere to go. From here, inhale, lift up into your side over. Exhale, like a one-arm downward dog, reaching with your hand to the opposite leg. Inhale, back into your side plank. Exhale, lower down. Two more. Watch your shoulder, take care, draw it down. Inhale up. Exhale, reach across. Back into side plank. And lower down. Last one. And up. And reach. And coming back and lower down. Now release your legs in any position and we'll stretch out the side we've just been supporting us with. Stretch over. Again, circle your hand, releasing your wrist and lift yourself up. Lovely, good. Come back onto your hands and knees and this time if we come back towards the back edge of the mat, tuck your toes under, lift your hips up and for a moment, knees bend or knees can be straight. Just hold your elbows and just let your spine release down. Just give yourself a little sway side to side. 
Let your head be heavy. And then we'll roll ourselves slowly all the way up. Good, we have one more exercise. We're going to inhale, stretch your arms all the way up towards. Exhale, open your arms out to the side, rolling yourself forwards, vertebrae by vertebrae. Bending your knees as needed, walk your hands out in four steps to the top of the plank pose. Meet me all the way top of the plank pose. You can keep your legs straight or rest your knees down. Three push-ups. Inhale lower, elbows tucked into the side of your body. Exhale, push up. Inhale, exhale up. Inhale, exhale up. Lift your hips up and back. Walk your hands all the way back, four steps. And roll yourself up to standing. And we'll do that twice more. Inhale, big stretch with your arms up. Exhale, roll yourself down. Head first, whole body follows. Four steps with your hands. One, two, three, four. Back into your plank. Knees straight or knees on the ground. Three push-ups. Shoulders drawing back. Elbows are pointing backwards. So making sure your arms are not out to the side. Push up. Lift your hips. Walk your hands back. And roll yourself slowly back up to standing. Last one. Inhale, big stretch up. Grow taller. Exhale, roll yourself forwards and down. And again, walk your hands forwards. Three, four. Last three push-ups. You can do this. Shoulders drawing back. Bending and straightening. Bend and straighten. Bend and straighten. Lift your hips up. Walk your hands all the way back. And roll yourself all the way up to standing. Big stretch with your arms up to the sky. And exhale, bring your hands all the way in. Place your hands onto your hips. And then just to finish with that balance, pressing into one foot. Pick up the other leg. Circle your foot. Releasing the ankle, moving your toes, and release your foot down. Same on the other side. Really standing tall on that standing leg, lifting up. And switch. And release. Roll your shoulders forwards, up and back. Thank you so much for making the time and for joining me today. Have a great rest of your day.